Mom, Dad, if you're watching this video. One thing I've noticed, being Prego. As soon as he saw it, he just kind of started freaking out. Like it was, you know, the Death Star. We're gonna make a new show called Chopped Toddlers. And salutations, my friends. Yes, it is I, Gert, starting the vlog today. We are out and about on a walk. Um, we are just gonna go probably around the neighborhood really quick and then Oliver is gonna need to take a nap and Daddy is apparently pushing him. Sorry, I'm having some trouble here. So we're just gonna go around really quick because it's a really nice day. It's really nice and warm. It's supposed to be like 87 today and then like 92 tomorrow. So we're gonna get out here before it gets too hot and just have some fun. And we don't really have too big of plans for today, do we? Um, might go and shoot some new pictures, uh, some new family photos of all three of us together. We don't have Actually, that many photos of us all together. We have a lot of photos of us individually, but not of us together. So that might be a goal for today. So who knows, maybe the botanical gardens again or something like that. And then we have this guy. Ooh, oh, he took them off, but he was wearing cool shades. when you have a giant watermelon in your stomach, well, not in your stomach, but inside you, it pushes on your stomach, making less room for you to eat. So I barely eat anything and I'm stuffed, like feeling like I'm gonna die, I'm so full. And then like a half hour later, I'm starving again. So we made this huge breakfast this morning. Eggs, bacon, toast, hash browns, and I had like two eggs and some toast and I, I was toast. <laughs> and I just, I couldn't eat for like an hour. And then I was starving again. And so then I ate half a plate of hash browns, so. That's, that's my update. Like a champion. Are you just kicking back and relaxing? Little chicken leg up in the air. Enjoying the sunshine. Oh, and mom, dad, if you're watching this video, uh, I just want to let you know, we're ready for you to move here whenever you're ready. We found a house for you. Looks nice, for sale, right now. It's really cute, not too far away. If you buy this house, we will tell you what the baby's name is. So we just got back and we put Oliver down because he is tired. So tired, just been rubbing his eyes for the past hour and a half. We had a late breakfast this morning, uh, so he shouldn't be hungry or anything, uh, but he is tired and we put him in his room and tried to lay him down and it is not going well. Gretchen just went back in there to try and calm him down, but uh, typically we just would want him to cry it out a little bit and he usually gives up pretty quickly, but we just put a little tiny fan up on the bookcase and as soon as he saw it, he just kind of started freaking out like it was, you know, the Death Star. And uh, so Gretchen's going to go move it. I think she's going to maybe put it on the floor or in the closet or somewhere where he can't see it. Maybe it won't bother him, but we're hoping he takes a good nap because uh, it's a hot day, a big day. We've got, you know, photos planned, maybe a trip to the Botanical Gardens. Um, we may even bust out his little swimming pool, so we want to get him some rest. So hopefully he takes a nap and 
the kiddos here, the kitty and the, the dog here, they are zonked out. Super tired. The cat, just because she's always tired. I, I don't know why she doesn't do anything. And then the dog, because he just went out in 85 degree weather and it is hot and humid. So. So little man finally went down for a nap. It sounds like he's sleeping for the moment. And that just means, you know, nap time here in the Carter house. Sleepy. 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 So instead of napping, I'm actually going to try and cut my hair because sometimes I cut my own hair because it's more convenient, kind of, and cheaper. And hopefully it doesn't come out terrible. Haircut done! And guess what? The little man is awake. What are you doing? Are you smiling and all happy? Are you watching the kids on Chopped Jr.? Chopped Jr.? We're gonna make a new show called Chopped Toddlers. That sounds awful. You're right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> not, not like. <laughs> that wasn't what I meant. Chopped Jr. Like the, the kids doing the cooking and not not chopped toddlers. Like, oh my gosh. It would just be all mac and cheese. It's true. <laughs> Foods toddlers eat all mac and cheese. Oh goodness. Moving on. So we are over at the Toledo Botanical Gardens and we've just arrived. Ollie is here with Mama. And it looks like a wedding. It looks like a wedding is just finishing up here and they just had their ceremony. So luckily we're not interrupting yet. I think it's over. But uh, yeah, we're gonna walk around and try and find a good place to take some pictures. I'd give my life, I'd give it all. For a look, for the call, for a kiss, for a road A part of any universe, of any planet, any sky Brought in motion by your light, you're a star in the night You keep me up when you say Have you ever seen so much bird poop on a bench? The same bench that Gretchen likes to sit on. I'm probably sitting in it. That's okay. You're wearing black, so it'll like, you know, just make it look like design. Well, my pants are white, so, oh, that's true. you know. <laughs> you move the mountains in my way Make me whole, make me sway Keep me up, keep me sane And let me love you all the same Send in the trumpet, send them all Call it fire oh. in the hall Come to life, oh, let God, it sir. know You give me all oh, that I say Do you see me now? Do you see me now? Like I see you now That's not a duck. What is that? A beaver? Is that a beaver? Or an otter? Or... You see that? We just saw like a beaver or an otter or something. I think it was a beaver, right? I think so. I wouldn't. I don't think otters live here. I saw a, a, a <laughs> tail, so I'm pretty sure it was a beaver. Yeah. I don't know where otters live, but I feel like it's not here. Beavers maybe, but that's cool. I don't know if I've ever seen a wild beaver before. So uh, we took a couple pictures. 
but it's really, really hot. And Ollie's not doing that great. And neither, am I. neither is Gretchen. It's hot. And uh, it's very crowded. Multiple weddings going on right now. So we may have to come back another day. We'll see what we got, but we didn't get very many photos. And uh, I doubt they were all that great. So we'll see what we got. But we're going to head on home and cool off and grab a drink of water. So we were on our way home and Gretchen said, hey, you know what sounds really good on a hot day? A Coke slushy. If any of you have ever had one, they're amazing. Great on a hot day. And Gretchen said, get a small one. And what did you get? I don't know. It looks like an extra large. It's this big. But it was 89 cents. And who can say no to an 89 cent drink this size? So, you know. That's the problem with America. <laughs> Or that's what's great about America. Depends how you look at it. Look at him, he's so cute! <laughs> Thanks for sitting down with us, Bubba. Can you say bye-bye? Can you say bye-bye to everybody? Say bye. You know. <laughs> and he's gone. But it was a good moment. It would have worked out nicely. So, thanks for tuning in today and uh, Shout out to uh, The Real Family Journey. Real Family Journey is awesome. And uh, we really love you guys. And I uh, wanna see you guys be successful and succeed. And uh, thank you so much for, you know, uh, following us on like Twitter and Instagram and, uh, you know, just sharing some of our stuff on social media. That's really cool of you guys. So shout out to you guys. People go check them out. They're awesome. Uh, they've got two little ones named Pops and Finn, and they are adorable. So check them out. If you like Ollie, you'll like Double the Fun with Pops and Finn. So we will see you guys in the next video. Peace. Whoopah!